If you look back into history, there is no country on the planet and there is no problem of any country of the planet that has been solved in a sustainable, in a positive way by nationalists and populists. So nationalists and populists are very strong playing with people's fears, but they're not strong in delivering on long-term national priorities. And because of that, I worry that what we see, for example, today in Italy, where out of the top four political parties, uh, three are nationalistic and populistic. I think what goes wrong in Italy, and I'm very much worried about that, is that voters actually in Italy send a very clear message that they're not willing to take responsibility. Voters in Italy are pointing at Eurosceptic, supporting Eurosceptic parties because they play with the European Union as convenient excuse for national mismanagement. But what happens in Italy or what happened in Greece doesn't have much to do with Brussels. It is a national mismanagement, failure of willing to adapt to new competitive standards educational standards, industrial standards and evolution, and being capable of reforming deeply your societies, as for example some other nations and countries have done.